Okay, this is uh, February 17th, uh, 2019, and the Daytona 500 is going on. It's about halfway through in the background, so it kind of marks the date. And the reason I'm here today is to show off my latest project, and this engine is for sale on Kijiji. Uh, this, is, this is called in the circle track racing uh, confines uh, 604. It's also CT. Uh, 400, sorry, 6400. So if you Google that, or ZZ6, it's exactly the same engine in the GM performance catalog. So this engine was used in a race car, and it had 2,000 laps, and that's half a mile a lap, so that's about 1,000 miles. And since then, I've done a complete rebuild on it. Uh, I've just broken in earlier, uh, and uh, it's uh, ready to show. It's warm right now, so I'm going to start it up and show you how nicely it runs. Uh, these engines uh, in circle track racing, if you ever watch an APC race or all over North America really, they have the standard engine. Uh, they are mandated with a chip that doesn't let them go over 6400 RPM, so this engine has never been over 6400 RPM. Uh, and I've done a complete rebuild, I have total diagnostics and detailed specifications for it since I've started it. Uh, I've actually done a leak down test and a compression test and the numbers are right on. Uh, so I can guarantee you this engine will be good. Now, I'm selling this engine exactly the way it is in the GM catalog, so that means the accessories like the carburetor, distributor, water pump, headers, etc. don't go with the engine. It's complete from the oil pan uh, right up to the top of the intake manifold. Uh, everything else is, belongs to my desk stand. In fact, this carburetor is almost 50 years old. Uh, so, uh, and the distributor is about 45 years old. So. They were actually in this Camaro. This engine, by the way, is uh, exactly the same engine as I have in this Camaro. So you can come around here and see how they look dressed up. Uh, it's been in this car for now for three years. This also is in a circle track car. And I never did rebuild this one. It just went in the way it was and it's run just great. Uh, it runs fine and that's how they look dressed up. Uh, the valve covers, oil pan and all that are your call uh, for the asking price. I'll um, give you whatever oil pan and uh, covers that you want. So let me give us a quick start and then you can uh, see and listen here how it runs and if you're interested in buying it, you can come and see it. These engines have all the good parts, forge crankshaft, uh, they have the, the fast burn aluminum heads, uh, the good rods, hypertech pistons, roller camshaft, and uh, they'll run big on a dyno, that one was down at 453 horsepower. Uh, typically they down at about 430, so that's about what this one would produce. So let me start it up and let you hear how nice it runs and then that'll be it, okay? Thanks for watching. 